This is a real nice spot. We've got four different species of carnivorous plants, all very, very close to each other. Yeah, we have some butterworts, yellow butterwort. They all seem to be young plants though. I don't see any any adults. There's no flowering. This is the biggest cluster that I found over here. There's really only a sporadic sprinkling of them. Looks and then of course the ever ubiquitous pink sundew. And we head over here, and we have Drosa and Drosera, Drosa, whatever, Intermedia. You can see how big it is compared to those teeny tiny little pink sundews. They're just all over the place out here. Man, just look at them all. And last, but certainly not least, are these lovely little yellow flowers here. It's the aquatic. Okay, that yellow bladder work before that, the utricularia, that was actually a uh, subterranean species. Um, I couldn't actually find the bladders. And as you can see here, this one has a pink flower. A purple flower. It's flowing out here in the middle of this great big old puddle. So that's actually one, two, three, four, five species. Freaking awesome. Alright, here we can actually see the floating traps of the Uticularias. These are a much smaller species than much smaller species than what we have in Jersey. There we go, you can see them pretty good right there. All those little bladders. <clears throat> well that's freaking cool. It's a pretty sweet spot. You can kind of see that's the trail I came in on. But we are just, we're in water. This whole little plain right here is flooded. Some frogs calling over there. No Saracenia, unfortunately, but the tricks were pretty sweet. And just the fact that everything else was all in the same, you know, 20 foot square piece of land, it's pretty awesome. It's kind of weird because that's the way it tends to happen. It just tends to Cluster together. Rowing in the barren lands. Look at the color of this thing. Holy crap.